Byron has been an absolute machine in iRacing. Listen to this, Steve. In well over 1,400 starts, this is like the third one right now. Right. He's at nearly 700 top fives, 293 wins. You want to add Sunday at Bristol to that total. In his 76 career cup starts, Byron's had five top five finishes and is still searching for that first victory on asphalt. Well, I think Sunday shows behind the wheel of any sort. William is the one to watch, and he joins us here on SportsCenter this Sunday evening. Bottom line, you led the most laps at the first two races at Homestead and Texas Motor Speedway in iRacing, but no wins to show for it. So what was different for you Sunday? Yeah, we just uh, kind of closed out the deal. It's, um, it's been a lot of fun. You know, I've enjoyed it. Obviously, my background's kind of with iRacing, so uh, I've had fun with it, and it's cool to see guys like Kyle Busch and, uh, Jimmy Johnson on there and be able to race against them for the first time on there. So it, it's a, it's a good uh, chance for that we have right now to, um, to do something fun. You're also racing against them as well. When the cup circuit does resume your proficiency in the world of I racing ended up getting you a cup spot. We just mentioned right before you came on, how many times you had raced on that circuit and how it helped you. How did that help you on the cup circuit? Really for me, it's what got me started. You know, I was watching, uh, the real NASCAR races on TV when I was a kid. And, and uh, that's what eventually led to me getting into a race car for the first time. So um, I'm very fortunate that it's taken off like it has during this time. And I feel like um, for me on the, on the cup circuit, I just try to learn from my racing, try to take little tidbits of advice uh, and use it towards my real racing career that I have on Sundays. So um, I feel like it's kind of a, an edge that I can have. And luckily we have a sport uh, like ours with NASCAR that, that the cars are very similar on that platform. So it's, it's uh, a lot of cool to race on there. And I feel like I still use it to try to learn. Hey, last thing for you. People have said in no uncertain terms that iRacing has been a quote unquote savior for motorsports in the yeah. whole industry. What do you think when you hear that? Well, I think it's true. You know, we're, we're fortunate um, during this time that, you know, we've missed a lot of races. We, uh, we've been through four races so far this year, but we race 38 times a year. And we've missed, um, so far, I think, seven or eight races. So uh, we have to use this, ultimately, is the only thing that we have. And um, I'm lucky that I can do it right now. And I'm just uh, excited to get back on the, on the racetrack sometime soon. But I know right now, this is kind of what we have. And, um, you know, it's, it's our chance to show the world what uh, racing is really like. And also... I feel like relate to young kids out there that can do this too. Yeah, well said. From the invocation from Daryl Waltrip on Sunday, he won a dozen major races at Bristol to the race and your win. It was quite a day for motorsports fans and sports fans out there in general. Congratulations again. Yeah, thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.